Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Ade Mansyah and I'm from class A on a semester third semester. And this is my final exam of academic speaking subject. Uh, in this section or topic, the topic that I will bring this time is about religion and peace. Uh, first of all, uh, what is religion? A religion is a kind of belief in a spiritual way like uh, superhuman gods goddesses or whatever uh, we call it and there are many religions in this world and uh, what's the correlation between a religion and uh, peace uh, this time uh, I will talk about uh, th this topic um, that is uh, religion and uh, peace uh, many many uh, religion in this world uh, have taught us a good way uh, especially uh, how to be a good person in this world and when it comes to an end of our life uh, when we die and we go to an afterlife and sometimes uh, it's very hard to understand because there are many many religions and a different ways of worshiping and a different way to pray uh, and the concept of a, a religion itself like uh, the ones uh, teach us to worship to gods that uh, that that's not have a uh, any physics and the other one uh, has taught us to worship a god or goddesses and yeah there are many religions in this world because of that um, many many uh, events uh, happens because of this religion so uh, what is a correlation between religion and peace well it's simple because uh, no matter what is your religion uh, what's your god or your goddesses they all teach us how to be a good person and uh, yeah we need we need to pray to them we worship them and we get good things and hopefully we don't we don't mess with with our life because when we die it's like i said before when we die and we go to a uh, afterlife um either we, we will go to heaven uh it, it's a place for people like uh they're doing good things uh, good deeds in this life and are we going to help that's a place when we um do a bad things life such as um stealing people, uh, murdering, uh, kidnapping, or whatever a uh, crime is. Um, so, uh, many, many religions in this world have taught us a good way to be a good human. But, and also, uh, there is a, uh, what, 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 what I call it, um, a religion also have a bad uh, worshippers, uh, such as, uh, um, for example, uh, in Muslim, we have uh, ISIS. Those people are a Muslim. They are worship uh, Allah, and yeah, they 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 have a faith in their life, but they just do a bad thing because our our lessons are different. They like to do a bad thing, such as uh, killing people and. In a Christian, they are um, army of Christ. They 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 didn't like to uh, doing a thing in this modern world. They force. Uh, they they did not like an abortion. Um, and when it comes to Buddhist um, or Buddha, we call it in Indonesia. Uh, they are also a uh, extremist uh, people that worship that God, but they're still uh, doing a bad things for uh so what i'm trying to say here is no matter what your really your religion is we are all same our gods or goddesses or whatever uh teach us to be a good person in this world and those religion uh never taught us to to do uh, bad things in this life because i believe every religion in this world is bringing a peace to our life when it comes to a supernatural life but and also when you when you do the uh, the, the things that 
the religions say and you you do it uh, yeah you just you just uh, commit a, a good life because no no religions teach us to be a bad person it's just their their wrong mindset and it's their radical mindsets that drove drove them to be a bad person in this world so that's it for me um, I think that's enough Thank you so much. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.